How does a lighter work? What is it fueled with? Maybe, uh... This? I don't know. Let's go find out. This is what you're gonna need. A screwdriver, and a lighter. I got this lighter from the dollar store. Alright, this screw right there, uh, we need to unscrew it because that's the main screw. Alright, once it's unscrewed, you can turn it over and you can try to get it out, but it may not come out, so it doesn't really matter. Then you have to get this thing and slide it off. Just a little metal, not metal, plastic. Oh. So now we're going to pop it off. Alright, there we go. So, this is pretty much all what's inside a lighter. So, right here is, this is the butane flask, um, or canister. So, the butane is in there, and butane is, in natural state, it's a gas. But when it's under slight pressure, it turns into a liquid. So, that's why it's liquid. And if I let some out, you would see nothing. Um, and pro in the butane is also the propellant in most spray oil cans. So, you can make a little flamethrower, and I may do a video about that at some point, so look forward to that. So, right here, this thing, that little switch looking thing, is a flame adjuster. Now, you can hack into that and make it so it can go really far and make a monstrous flame. So the stock setup is that it goes from here, which is big flame, to here, which is small flame. But the big flame is pretty anemic. It's only about that long. So what's the fun of that? So what you do is you can turn it. Then you pop off the little thing, rotate it back to the small. That'll give us a monstrous flame. So now we're going to put it back together. So after modifying that little valve, we can get a big flame. Let's make it bigger. Pretty cool. So, you got to learn how a lighter works, and also how to make the flame really huge. Making the flame huge does burn fuel fast. So, once you do it, I'd recommend taking it apart, which I'm going to do, and making it back to normal. So, the flame's a little bit less uh, crazy. Let's see if I can make it to go again. There we go. And it sort of just goes a little bit because it's so much fuel. So, bye you guys, thanks for watching, and click on the big flame to subscribe. This is why big flames are useful. So we can get it to go. There we go. How to start a bonfire pretty quickly.